Hi everybody, today is the poster 598, so let's type it 598 and we are August 20, 2020. Let's type it there, remove the 2020 of the Apollo 2020 and put the 2020 near Apollo there. Done. That's for the layout. I imported to brain. I'll make it smaller. I select them, I put them outside of... I put them outside of the layout uh, please go outside <clears throat> there um, I want to put them in the center of the canvas here tech <clears throat> um, so um, I got some uh, some message on uh, YouTube and uh, someone said uh, uh, that he already start to do a poster design challenge and uh, didn't finish it and fail. And uh, I would like to say that the fails mean, uh, oh, what does that mean? fail first attempt in learning so it's a first attempt in learning fail that's a acronym and uh, yeah i think it it changed the sense we give to this word to this word for um for make a mini series uh mini series uh daily poster design challenge you you have to do it if you have a website you 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 create a post and you talk about uh yeah you say you say that you will uh, create a poster every day and you you let know the people that you are doing that and once you say that you have to do it so every morning you wake up a little bit earlier earlier and you you do it whatever it takes whatever the time you spend on it you do the poster every day you have to push yourself to to do it it's not easy every day there are some days where i totally have no inspiration these days are tough because you have to work, you have a family, you have things to do on the side and uh, inspiration is not coming. But once you open Photoshop and start to record your screen for put your video on YouTube, I mean, it's turning. The, the video is, uh, is showing, my voice is record and the only things you have to do is to jump into the poster and do it. And that's how I push myself to do it. The first year, I just record the screen, not my voice, because I'm not an English speaker. My native language is French. And there are many stuff I don't know how to express in English, but I think it can be a good idea to improve my English and it's nice in on the other end because speak English make me think simple and I come up sometime with idea I don't have in French and sometimes I dream in English crazy so you you really have to push yourself to do this poster every day create a little layout you create a, a file that you copy every day with the templates and uh, you change the date the number like i do there 
put your name, maybe your logo, and you find images on pixels.com, unsplash.com, or other website, morgue files, but find free royalty, free, free image, uh, like on uh, iStock or others uh, website like that they say it's free ro royalty free but once you pay uh, a good amount of money for the picture and they are not uh, free to use for commercial they are only uh, free to use uh, as a personal personal project and if you plan to sell your poster take good care of the image uh, rights and copyrights because it can be very, very boring, uh, like uh, I did with the Apple. I pay around uh, $60 for use the Apollo image. And uh, after I uh, found uh, information that I have to pay uh, $180 for uh, use the image on a commercial project. And uh, I am limited about the the print I can have and the project I can make with uh, this image. And it was pretty boring and I was disappointed because, uh, yeah, it's relatively good amount of money. It's not a lot for sure. The photograph have to, uh, the photographer have a lot of uh, work to do and uh, it's, uh, it's fair. The price is very low for, for that. But in the other end, I'm not sure I will sell something. I'm not sure I will make money with that. And I pay a little bit less than $200. So yeah, it's not really okay. After the problem is to find uh, large enough images. And uh, that's uh, something else. My uh, The format I use is uh, A1. So it's really huge Canva. The, brain there is around uh, 500 pixel uh 5000 5, pixel <clears throat> uh okay no yeah yeah around that uh, size and uh, it's pretty pretty huge because it is a 3d render uh it's a uh, it's a file i bought uh, somewhere online and uh i made render with a blender about uh, this brain so he he's big enough but the picture you find online usually are relatively smaller they make a little square there and uh, it's not that good so uh, let's uh, design the poster today <coughs> oh should stop the air conditioner um but like uh, like today, I, I don't really know what I what I will do except that I have the brand and I know it's a mini series. For that, it's a little bit luck because I know I will use the brand and make uh, something uh, iridescent uh, color on it. But uh, yeah, for the next part, I have totally no idea about uh, what I will do how I will compose my uh, my brand there. It's uh, It will be a surprise, uh, same for myself. It's like that when you have no customer, no constraints. For the first year, the constraints was to, to use Apollo, the picture of Apollo on each poster and use the same font and uh, I did that uh, all along the year. Mm, maybe sometimes I get rid of uh, Apollo's picture and uh, and the font. I use something else, but yeah, it was because I uh, I want to explore something else, and I was a bit tired about uh, Apollo's picture. So now. What was, what was I about to do? Uh, yeah, 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 I will merge these two brain and create uh, 
iridescent style by using the filter other high pass over the brain let's see what happens there not okay Ooh. what will i come up with with that style exclusion you saturation you you yeah not bad not bad oh damn copy paste it and uh, use another uh, high pass i want to see uh, <clears throat> how the radius pixel amount i use uh, will change the style the colors i can come up with okay let's try 156 let's see what happens Ooh, you, you, you. hey divide Ah, yeah, it's because I have the, the brain there under. If I change it. Yeah, not that bad, huh? That's really an iridescent uh, brain. And what uh, it looks like with a uh, black background. Hmm, not. It's not what I want. You. Yeah, man, I prefer uh, prefer that one. Huh? Since that one is what is good to. No, no, this one is okay. Um, copy and paste. See what it what it happens with a Gaussian blur over it. Uh, Thirteen is maybe too small. Oh, things happens. Okay, no Gaussian blur today. I remove it. I'll go on the brain and select uh, some uh, colors. As usual, oh, that's dirty color. Yeah, not bad. Let's take a dark, darker red. It's not really dark. Pink there. Okay, it's yellow. I want a light green. I like this light green. Yeah, there yeah. are some other color too. That pink. That dark blue and see what happens when i put a background a colored background behind these two brain the blue not bad not bad the pink fine lighter color mm, not that good hey And the pink, the two pinks, pink looks good. And the blue is not that bad too. But I want a light background. The problem is that it's not okay. Uh, yeah. It look like uh, or orange uh, vermeil. Well, I don't know how to say that in uh, in English. I hope it's the same word. Eh. Yeah, it's uh, orange, which uh, look like uh, look like a red, almost. 
now you can see it <coughs> you can see it clearly <coughs> oh my god uh, so i select the font my layout there and uh, want to change them into a color to another color okay come there character color swatches let's see what happens if i select this light green and it looks it looks a, mm, well contrast but too much contrast yeah this blue also contrasts relatively well and it is fine because it's a light and darker uh, contrast the, the the green color was too excited yeah the the mix between this orange and the green is really too excited it's uh, almost uh, more interesting to see the green and this background than the brain and that's not what i want to do so i select this little one there select the color i use for the font one click done i get rid of the vector smart object goodbye well, here we are with this uh, two brain. Ooh. Merge. And I can. Hey, 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 hey. Ah, they are not perfectly aligned. Select the two. Layers, tack, tack. Now they are aligned, they are well aligned. Okay, I can remove them. Save the document. Often save the document as much as you can in case if there is something wrong or Photoshop crashes because it's very boring to start again something you did oh yeah it's really terrible so it is the gold brain number 18 19 oh la la gold Brain number 19. That's for the title. Let's place it there today. No, not fine. Oh, you, 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 you. Not that much. No, no, you can sell. Minus ninety degrees to be perfect. Come on. I want you to be centered in the canvas. Oh, come on. There.
So here we are. And now I am thinking what the next step to take. And the next step is a coffee. See you soon. So the time of uh, make me a coffee and come back and still have no idea about what to do. Maybe these brain are too huge. So let's find a proper proportion, a proper proportion. <laughs> Maybe that's fine like that. Uh, what can I do now? Yeah, I was about to think. Uh, maybe, maybe I want, I want huge font. Mm. What is a brain? What can I write? Uh, working to. Working tool, nice idea. Yeah, tracking. Oh, maybe less twenty. It's fine to me. Yeah. <coughs> Too expanded. Semi-expanded. Mm. Looks nice. So let's have a look about her ball version. Mm. <coughs> oh. <coughs> oh no. No, 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 no. It's not possible. I cough. It's because the air conditioner. I get, I catch a cold because of that. Oh no, it's terrible. It's not possible. Three weeks ago, I, I get sick because that. If it happens to me now, it won't be possible. Working tool. Working tool. Yeah, that's my working tool. Maybe a blend mode would be nice. Ooh. Oh, lo, 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 lo. multiply is fine. Yeah, linear burn too. Darker now. No, no, no. 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 Not bad. But not strong enough. Difference two time. Three time. Oh, looks weird. Okay, let's see what happens with the other one. Yup, no, no. Multiplier was the best, the best option. But, looks a bit strange. Walking to no, it's not fine. Working too. Ah, I don't know. Let's try to add some text there, but what can I write? Let's use a regular. Type 
<coughs> still huge. Side view. Very simple. What are you looking for, Photoshop? Side view, just click there, please. Hey, it's not a big deal. So come on. Get rid of the tracking here. Happening now. You select the text and you write into there. It was not complicated. Side view of the right hemisphere. For not of the no copy it. I push Alt, Shift, and drag and drop it. <coughs> I'm catching a cold or what? No, no. Stop it. Can't cough now. Side view, right hemisphere, top view, left hemisphere, right hemisphere. Okay. Hmm. Something is missing. That's too huge. Nine. Yeah. Mm. 
behind everything. to I very good and you a little bit down and here we are just like if I use a grid to do that this is not the case Oh. The placement is okay. See, it appears between the brain. It's not a good idea there. Where is this horizontal line there? Ah, oh, no, no, not you. Yeah, I just let uh, a bit uh, appear outside of the canvas because I am sure it will touch the side.
going to in the center of the canvas here my name should go up a little bit <coughs> I should continue the shape there with the pen tool. If now I will get an angle, an ugly angle. No. just for place this line in the center of the canvas yeah come on go don't be afraid yeah <coughs> Let's place another lines here and here on the canvas and see what happens. Yeah, usually for that, uh, much better to use a grid, but I prefer to make it visually today, it would be faster. square there remove the stroke and put to fill place it there too Save the document in case if <coughs> I 
so I think it looks it looks good for today. Yeah, it's uh, it's fine uh, fine poster, right? Brain of you, oh, yeah. It's done. Yeah, it looks uh, it looks good. Um, I don't really like the area there. A bit too much blue and the color yellow appear too much there, but. Uh, that's because of the effect, so I think it's uh, it's fine like that. And uh, yeah, well, it's not so bad. The grid uh, looks uh, funny and brings something uh, good uh, to the poster. Um, um, yeah, it's uh, it looks fine. See, I think I'm finished, but I get an ID there. Very simple ID, yeah, of course. Oui. Um, ellipse tool may place relatively huge circle here. Over the brain. Maybe another one more bigger. Should get rid of that. Yeah, why not? Why not? Maybe this brain, this circle should be something like here. Yeah, just fine there. Okay, maybe, maybe. Just a few elements, but really a few little elements to help the eyes start introduce itself to the poster and direct it into. Oh. Let's copy it, place it there. place an horizontal lines here too. <clears throat> yeah, the problem with that is when you start, it's difficult to stop and uh, there are a point where it will be too much. So 
should take good care of the too much okay better to move you with the cable touch yeah you looks fine and what if I add one there on this line there No, no, too much. I think we are done for today. Thank you to follow along uh, this poster tutorial creation or process. I hope you like it because uh, Great, make it uh, look uh, very nice. I think uh, there is something uh, working well. By the degree that we integrate uh, the different part of the poster and the two views of the brain, the uh, that looks fine. Uh, everything looks fine. I was a little bit afraid in the start uh, because the the working tool title is probably too melting with the colors of the brain but uh works just fine and i like this orange and blue colors together it really looks fine and i believe that i will use them to celebrate uh, poster number 600 eh? only two poster to go for that i will uh, use uh, illustrator i think to create something because it's just perfect we are the <clears throat> poster miniseries gold brand 19 tomorrow will be the 20 so it will be the 21 august the 22 august will be the poster 600 so the miniseries will stop at that day hey, yeah i am here oh, sorry still early morning <clears throat> i am in a hurry to to celebrate the poster uh, 600 really i am i am a little bit thinking about what i will do and i think i will use a 600 element but uh, nothing is sure so thank you to come there to follow this poster tutorial and uh, i uh, wish you to have a nice day a nice and safe day at home or whenever you want if you can uh, I see you tomorrow for the poster 599. See you.